Wolfie forced to retreat for a second, but now... Let me take a look over control once again. Different angle this time around. He sees somebody, so he should give the callouts and gonna take a few shots. Only one landing on a frag, though. Numbers have even doubt so far. Vigusena. Putting some pressure with smoke as well. Trying to make their move. Sander is still gonna be looking up on heaven next, though. I think he's gonna have an easy time taking that one home. Nyx now has to look everywhere. He knows that there's somebody around. He's gonna miss that one. Nyx finding a second frag right there. Now Umar. A huge task ahead as there are still three players here for Pain. Pain Gaming starting out with a bang quite literally. A few more just to get the Though final. We've seen the way that Pain are shooting today and it's just been looking amazing so... It could all be decided as when the first challenges come right here. Sami gets dealt with immediately by Nex. So they were ready for that position. Quite common to play on top of Pot. And what a great execution that we just witnessed here from Pain. They just covered the most common spots. And they were so ready to even try to make something. And the pressure... Would save has his routes on check. But might be time for him to start getting some Ooh. work done with that up and line. Right as I say that... Umar lands the headshot on Zebi, or not a headshot, just the kill on Zebi. So the numbers are now even again, and Umar is going to go on a rampage. He gets Damn. three kills to his name just now. Skulls and Hearts out, still alive. I think Skulls is bound to find Nyx here. Yes, of course he will. After some bullets flying by, and Hearts out, unfortunately, oh my will God. fall to. Out there in the open, not gonna be an easy chance here for him to try and take the shot. He has to take the fall, Ace. and Umar in the end. There's also the fact that if Take Flight claimed this one, they're gonna be setting themselves up oh my God. for some good comebacks too. I mean, the momentum will be on their side and they already take down two. Like I told you, Roy, if they really wanted to claim those rounds, they need that two people, two player lead because if not, in gaming yeah. have shown they have the strats to play around with that deficit and now they're able to simply overwhelm the rest. Granted, they need to take care of Hard Zao and unfortunately they seem to have lost protection oh. of A-side for a little while, but only one player remains and that's Zebi who is still peeking into heaven, and I don't think that anybody has his number quite yet. Nobody checking the fence, but still, very complicated spot for him to be in. One minute remaining, bump not near him. So he needs to commit to moving on. Umar, ooh, if he peeked ever so slightly more, might have been able to see the weapon peeking, and there you go. Upper versus upper is one by Zebi. kill, now three. And here we go, this is how it starts. Umar landing a headshot through the smoke onto Biguzera. Fantastic work from him. Forces Pain Gaming to kind of take a step back and reconsider where they're going to approach. Sander, of course, must have heard that jump. And he is going to give the intel. You can see Wolf rotating and Semi as well going through the vents. So they are ready to protect all of that, Roy, because of one jump that they got to here. Now, of course, they do take down Xander, but here comes Simi. Gotta try and land those headshots. He is not able to, and instead, PNG, Pain Gaming, take down three team members from Take Flight. Man, that's just a heartbreaker. They had the intel, they had the rotation, but the execution just wasn't quite there. They're once again relying on Umar to land those shots, oh. and Nyx dies here, so he leaves Umar alone by himself. Oh. Will not get the headshot just yet, and the nose come will down once nothing to do with that here we go next breaking the windows he's also gonna find umar who did not have his sub oh. this round and so wolf being gone means that b-side is almost completely wide open with the exception of semi and now nix who is also approaching zevi gonna back down a little bit let's hope that timing does not hurt him nix does take down hard sal and semi takes down next it actually did change things around a little bit as two players have gone down from png's side pain we're gonna have to just hold on here. Zevi already shooting through whips, but he Ooh. will find Simi later when he peeks. And this is all she wrote, Roy. You go downstairs into B side and protect it. Now I didn't mention it. Zevi is down, but here you go. Umar ready to take them down right as they move along. And he oh. will not claim a single life. But here's Wolf to make it up for him. Gonna take a lot of damage from the fire, however, forced to back down. Xander is gonna what die is here. That? And Wolf right here and now. The lead that a couple of rounds was looking to be dwindled away has turned into a five round difference. Huge frag onto Vigusena there from Umar, though. Wolf 
Oh, the double not turned into a triple. Already plenty of damage and much better space to work with here. You feel that they can definitely make the distance because these two are in play and because they can lure everyone else out. Xander lands his seventh kill of the map. And even though Wolf was not able to do anything here, he does give the intel. Numer is going to step right up, get the headshot on Skulls. And of course, they know that they're going to approach B-side, so Sumi and Xander are already there, ready to protect it. But of course, it seems that the ramp is going to be wide open. Pain gaining, gaining a lot of distance, and they're once again gonna go for their util shenanigans, see if that can work for them. Hearts out, about to be sandwiched to death, maybe, but no! They're going to open the path once again, but Hearts out still gonna fall to this barrage of bullets and shooting through the smoke next is gonna catch sunny a lot of bodies are falling roy 2v2 it has definitely been thanks to that little split that they managed to get with the smoke right here because Sera is on the chase sander was ready and well, that so is far i mean it's it's looking perhaps much better than than what people were expecting here and you kind of need it to be good right here as it's the last round before the side switch and still even numbers but the hp on skulls is not looking too good they are still able to land the shots however only uma remains and it appears that pain gaming are going to get the last round that é ganhar 5 dólares de graça então entre agora no skins monkey logo com sua skin utilizando o link da descrição e clique em receber gratuitamente 5 dólares e pronto se você tiver skins que não curte mais no seu inventário o site é perfeito para você trocar suas skins que já enjoou em skins novas do seu gosto. Você vai ganhar até 40% de bônus utilizando o cupom ART para suas trades e dar uma moral pro canal, né? Agora não perde tempo, bora farmar suas skins novas para fazer aqueles highlights insanos. E lembrando, todas as trades de fevereiro vão ocorrer ao sorteio exclusivo. Para participar, é só enviar um print da sua trade no meu Instagram. Tamo junto, guys, e vamos para o vídeo de hoje how they do on each well not only is nuke the the map that they have played the most they have a 75 percent win rate off rounds across the board and t side is not that bad for them 55 percent but ct is where it's at 60 percent win rate for them and here you go it seems like it's not going to start super well we know that the piston run on the side such is crucial for the losing team as they might just be able to get some momentum going if take flight climb the bomb that's a huge bonus and they are successfully gonna plant it only zebi and bigo zeta remain and here you go this is bound to be an interesting show on umar on guard he sees because that are coming not gonna be able to take him down and they're gonna lure everybody else out but roy it's a 2v2 all of a sudden oh that could have turned into a 1v1 and it has indeed it is sami from the distance with that usp he tries to land the shots not able to do so just yet can even be get his hands and he's gonna go for it but sami gets an easy shot because of that and not even able to get the frag so be is out they're gonna be forced to book it Sami does the same, and uh, quite a tough situation right there, but I mean, that little bit of extra verticality to play with. Sneary comes through, and Seti claims a two frags make that three to right off the rib. Will he find one more? Just tries to spray, and they end up cleaning everybody. Pain game. And when you see that 13 on the side of pain, you are for sure going to hear those alarms start going off. I think they already are, really, especially now that they'll lose a wolf. And even though they do have some attempted map control here, I don't see an easy way in for them to take A site. And B is also protected somewhat, as you do have Biguzetta looking outside, ready to catch Xander and Umar if they decide to move forward. Now, Umar might be able to win that battle. He does have an open hand, finally. Oh, but here, Skulls has already seen somebody peeking that semi. Nyx is not going to def uh to get the proper peak going now like i said omar was bound to win a showdown outside so at least he's able to make some damage on the side of pain gaming but they do have the entryways pretty much protected as sander goes down as well so he's gonna pick up the bomb but in a 2v1 you do have the upper to rely on but it's going to be super complicated especially when you have zevi here going on a prowl outside might just be able to catch umar from the back if he rotates appropriately and it has the right timing, but I don't know, Roy. They don't seem to be giving much space to move with. Sumi is going to enter the facility soon enough, and so will Umar. There you go. Trying to force the 1v1s, and Umar got to take the high ground. He will catch Hearts out from the back, oh. but unfortunately, once again, reloading a little too long. That's just the nature of the UB. It's do or die, and unfortunately for Take Flight, they were able to at least plant the bomb. Oh. Now it's a 2v1, and Semi will not be able to do much else. At least there is a little bonus.
Now here's the thing, they might let them cook for a little while, but I think the execution is going to pull them ahead in the end. Now unfortunately, because that is not able to win this fight right here, gets headshotted. They did not get to see Nex approaching from secret, so he might just be able to win that fight against Xander, he does! Once again, it's an advantage for Pain Gaming, as they have now decided to back down a little bit, see if anybody goes in to protect secret. No, it does not seem to be the case. I mean, a very interesting spot, way back, almost closer to T's, to their spawn itself. CT spawn. Umar takes on hearts out, however. The Yoppers once again being in play right here. Let's see how much Zevi is able to do afterwards. Skulls throws a smoke, knows that somebody's about to come through secret, and even though he tags both of them, lits up Umar a lot. He is not able to land the shots to kill just yet. Nex is not going to be able to stop the bomb plan either, but he will take down Umar. And only Wolf remains guarding A-side on the other side. He sees somebody jumping, still needs to take care of Secret though. About to be overwhelmed, oh. gonna shoot through the smoke. Almost oh takes god. down Zabby. And he takes down Nex. Oh, oh my god, Wolf! Survived with, it was nothing short of a miracle right there. But absolutely amazing play. Like in a much needed round there for take flight, however, they have yet to slow down the pace of Pain Gaming because take a look at this, they established the early numbers advantage. And let's not forget, they are still just a couple of rounds away. And with the bomb plants continually coming through, I can definitely see a path to victory for Take Flight. They're consistently able to buy all the loadouts they desire. And Pain, even though they're able to defend one side quite properly, I think they're... Taking their sweet time before rotating, and uh, take flight this time. Did not try and bait uh, and go for the bait and switch. You see, however, that the protection is coming through quite well. As Simi Ooh. is gonna take care of Zevi, massive, and he is gonna take. Care Trying to clean the outside before they make their move. Sander is gonna be dealt with though. The refrag comes immediately, and this is what we were talking about. Whenever. Pain are forced into semi buys Break rounds. They managed to do like what it What it seems like they are dealing with like three lives in just one. You know what I'm saying? Like they are just so effective at doing that, managing to get two frags and oh, this is bomb. a round that they were supposed to be losing, dude. This is a round that they were supposed to be slipping to letting their lead slip away. Sami, though, trying to change the curse of things once more. Because is not going to miss oh that my. shot. No way. As Sami is a task with pretty much the impossible now. Next, though, still only has to play with, but Biguseta is not going to let it. Make the full comeback, right? They are going to have to bank on overtime if they want to make it through, and it appears that oh, it's not going nice... to go their way initially. Fantastic incendiary there from Biguseta as well. And sure, the smoke is going to give Take Flight a little bit of playroom, but, you know, not going to be able to move into secret, which is just what Umar wanted. Now, Pain are still protecting A side with a bit more impetus, and you do see them taking down Wolf. Umar might be able to catch someone here. He does take down Biguzeta. Once again, it's the Opper putting his team on his back when they need him most. And he's still oh, the, man. one of the biggest killer. He is this tied for the biggest killer in the map alongside Skulls, but it seems that that's going to be all she wrote. Skulls has now reached 25 kills. And with only Sumi remaining, I think, Roy, that we're going to head into Vertigo soon enough because it's a 4v1. Sumi's about to be caught outside. He needs to get a, a frag right here if he wants to serve, uh, if he wants to even send a chance. And it appears that's not going to be the case. And it appears that the actions will simply take a little bit longer as Take Flight are going to only now start ambushing the ramp, throwing all their util at bay, and here you go. A few players start to fall already. You know, I was actually checking the stats from Pain Gaming on HL TV, and it appears that they generally just don't do super well on pistol rounds. <laughs> it's not just a coincidence that last map we saw them losing the pistol round on the side switch, and now we are also seeing them on a disadvantage here. There definitely doesn't seem to be much of much room for them to go through. Now, of course, the bait and switch might just be what they need. As here, they are going to take down Zevi. And unfortunately, even though Payne's own player was trying to lure them out, doesn't seem like T-Flight are going to lose cover of a site at all. Artsau is the only one left. No chance for him to even go in for a fake defuse. As there's no smoke being planted, there's nothing for him to do. He is going to book it now. And this piss around, the initial one, 
will go to take flight on their own map selection. Remember that no matter what side they're banking on, I'm sure that they're going to they try to turn play. the seemingly unwinnable into an actually decent chance, if not outright taking a dub for their eco rounds, perhaps. Not gonna be as easy this time around as it seems like Take Flight are very ready. Sami leading the charge here for the boys in yellow. And is gonna get pushed though. And a bit too much pressure being applied, not without taking a couple of frags first. But that discipline from Sevi, my god! And I, I have to say, a bit of a sloppy situation right there presented itself for Take Flight and they not checking their corners when. That is one of the few jobs you have to do. Just make sure that you're ready for that type of angle. And like I told you, all of a sudden... Painter in a much better spot. However, I think this bomb will not be denied. Let's see if Pain can go for a retake immediately, though, as they are setting themselves up for success. And they have done just that. Boost themselves up a little bit. Let's see if they can catch anybody. They're shooting through the smoke, so, you know... All those bullets are definitely going to tell Ping Aiming where to start rotating. The bomb will not be planted just yet. That was just a bait. So no timer just yet. 19 seconds to go. However, we are in the tail end of the round. Oh Another bait of plan, but of course, it's going to be frustrated oh, as there damn. was a fire being lit up. I mean, Ping have enough tools to slow any approach down to try to cover. Here's Coles. Gonna turn that one immediately into some damage, and Hardzao is uh, gonna close that one out. I don't know if we are being lied to by system right here, but nonetheless, it is a fact that four frags already came through. Take flight. A very solid angle, as it is, and the time has already run its course. So PNG Pain Gaming are going to get their fourth get a grasp of the situation yet again some shots gonna come through nobody falling just yet neat next is gonna be on the other side wolf gonna deal with that one swiftly biguseta though the guardian of the ramp making sure nobody makes it through to the other side that sevi deals with the flank immediately omar though this man that has been put into team on his back the designated upper for to take flight, boys. Gotta find a little of a cozier spot here to deal with an angle. Not the most promising situation here if you're take flight. Not an impossible one, though. They still have the bomb in hand, but the time is running away. And Sebi, oh my lord, hits the no scope. And Sami gonna leave Umar all by his lonesome, but he is gonna not gonna get aggressive just yet. Just gonna gain some position. Some bullets are gonna find next though. And so, oh, he's not able to close that one out. I thought because Sarah for sure was gonna get it after so much damage was been inflicted, but that bit of extra vertical position giving Nyx the time to react to the situation and get a frag off his own. However, the answer back. And this is going much better here for Take Flight. Sevi and Skulls, though, we've seen just sometimes it's all about a team effort. Like, you only, like, pain gaming sometimes only really need two players to make magic happen and be able to clutch out a situation. So, I wouldn't say that Take Flight are out of the woods just yet. Now, with the HP in hand, I could see Pain landing a couple of. Shots on Nyx and maybe even Wilkie to find those kills, but it's going to be very complicated. Ooh, Zebby not gonna whip here, finds Nyx. And whatever bullet landed on him oh was going to stop him now. Way. Oh, oh my god, so close! So close! The bullet's flying by millimetrically, but you already know the calculation. You turn around a single degree, that's going to be a huge curve. Oh my and god. The bullets path and take flight are still going to be able to claim that round after. And uh, I, I swear to God, those bullets from the up uh, on Sevi's part, they were guided by like God or someone, but to save a take flight, you know, like just guided out of trajectory. As that was almost uh, a very huge denial right there, which would have set things in motion in favor of pain, but instead, take flight are able to capitalize onto that. However, I think that they didn't quite like that as they are now 
fastly claiming all of, uh, like, with the quickness, claiming all the lives from Take Flight and once again, and There's a huge booth right here. You can see Zebby gonna be taken down by them all. And I was about to say, Summy was holding on to such a high angle, he is not gonna be able to take down Hearts Out. But of course, Hearts Out knows that somebody else is coming. And Biko's dead is gonna take care of them. Has a needed hand. Gotta throw oh, it. And that's oh, a round. A little bit more pressure towards the ramp side. Whereas the rest are working this stairs angle. Sevi gonna miss that one. And Umar is gonna take a frag off his own. Make that two and could be three in just a second. Next, gonna deny him of that. Still, the damage has been dealt. Even if still, the numbers are in the favor of pain by just one. Skull is going to have to transverse to the situation. Next, finding Sami, and this could be the final nail in the coffin for this round number 13. Nyx, time and time again, has found himself all by his lonesome, and this has been no exception. Not even having an angle to play with here. Unfortunate situation for him. Azia B is uh, definitely not free for its time being. You can you just know skulls can up to pressure that immediately. Just it takes a quick peek. Ten or so seconds to go here, and it's cool to see somebody. Not only that, but he has his sights set. Really, one member can change the whole dynamic of a team. It is a team game after all. And it's not all about somebody in a specific popping off. I mean, most uh, on, on PNG are actually looking quite even on the on the stat line. Umar, though, never disappointing. And uh, once more trying to lead the charge for his voice. Hearts out. With that frag. Adding to the pressure. That the take flight we're already feeling under. The crushing pressure at that. Umar though. Yet again, I'm, I'm telling you, this man steps up. However, he's not going to be able to play the rest of this round. He's going to have to leave it to his team. And unfortunately, his team has been reduced to only Nyx. Yet again. What can Nyx even do? He's stuck on the ramp. Might be able to go on a show down here, but... Oh, actually, Zebby, quite an aggressive... Really here if you're, if you're paying, however, let's... It's sometimes it's about the effort, and I'm... I'm sure Take Flight are still willing to put up a fight right here. Trades come through early, though. As Nyx and Sevi are no more. Next exchange is going to be in favor of Umar. He hears somebody on the other side. So he's going to take a little step back. Next, though, answers double with double. And right there for the backup. Oh, my lord. Next, with three frags to his name already, the bomb has been planted. And Sami has a huge task in his hands. He needs to get this round. But not only that, he needs to keep his life as well. Because the shots are flying through. And they hear that, so they're going to be hounding on that. <laughs> going for the knife <laughs> on the dark, my lord. Not like they can't do it, but... Can they show us the, the will to, to actually even try for that? I mean, you can only hope. Next going to be making it out of the ramp for the time being. Reclaiming more and more space here. Going to get pushed and going to miss those shots. The mass really cannot compete with an AK at the distance. Okay, Wilkie though. Gonna take advantage of that situation. Little distraction and that is gonna convert into a frag immediately. Bomb site is not open. Was not open just yet and Hard Sao still has Umar to look for him. And yep, he is gonna get caught right there. Take flight. Do not deny the bomb plant, but at the very least, they even the situation out in the numbers department. But that was a huge one, and Biusera ends up getting it. So it's looking like a perfect record here in Vertigo.
Yeah, a perfect record of 4-0 over the last three months. It's about to be tempt with. Now, they did take them because of that initially, but not long after the trade comes through. Wilkie seems to be here for recon purposes first and foremost. Gonna keep a, you know, his ears raised up. See if he can hear anybody approaching. Mm -hmm. Nexus also out. Ram seems to be completely shut off. And oh. here comes Wilkie. Lance a kill. Uber died on the other side. And Hearts already saw him. Not gonna let him live. But Hearts is gonna take a lot of damage too. He is gone. Only Skulls remains. And he needs to make this one count. Does not have the bomb in hand. Nyx. Nyx here with the boost. Should be able to get him. Oh, not gonna no. land a headshot. That one was crucial. And he wow. sees somebody else coming. Oh my god. Oh my god, Skulls. Oh my god. Throws another nade. Gonna deal a lot of damage to Nyx. Huge. No, no kill just yet, but they know the bomb is there. Oh, the panic it's volley. not even about the bomb. It's not even about the bomb anymore. Yeah, that was the last piece of util that Nyx had. Okay, he picks up a smoke. But still, what oh else can you do? God. He had the... He had util in hand, and he's gonna be taken.